Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy 88% here back for episode 44 of our Pokemon Crystal Rita here on the channel. Last time we took on two Elite Four members, Koga and Bruno, will we did on episode 42. Uh, so today we will take on the remaining Elite Four members and then we'll see what life has uh, in store for us basically. So if you're excited for that, make sure you smash the like button and smash that like button and subscribe because your support is very much appreciated uh, let's do a quick team recap because we do have some small updates unfortunately uh, up first we have unprogrammed the official now officially the <laughs> the oldest member of the squad uh, level 40 or level 45 Porygon 2 water and psychic typing holding on to that mystic water because he's a mysterious glitch now rocking surf side beam whirlpool and spore up next we have Manny here a level 45 typhlosion uh, hold, grass typing sorry holding on to that miracle seed power up the it's only stab solar beam also rocking Shadow Ball, Body Slam, and Stun Spore. Up next we have Patrick here, our fighter, level 44, 46, sorry, Nine Tails, Water and Fighting Typing, holding on to that Black Belt because he's a Karate Master. Rocking Crab Hammer, Waterfall, Dynamic Punch, and Withdraw. I might teach it, oh, that's not what I meant, but we'll get right to it. I was gonna say I might teach it sketch eventually to try to get a, a fighting type move uh, but yeah look at these stats though Rowdy is looking insane we have Rowdy here or widower because we'll get to that later Rowdy or widower with a uh, level 46 Raikou normal and ground typing holding on to that pink bow because he's a classy man <laughs> Rocking Return, Boomerang, Spike Cannon, and Wing Attack. Up next we have Gyarados here, or a Tsunami, I should say, or level 47 Gyarados here. Uh, flying and Fire Typing, holding on to that Charcoal the Memento from Kyle, I forgot to say that uh, last episode. Rocking Drill Pack, Flamethrower, Megahorn, and Fly. And... Yeah, we're, we're not going to talk about this. Uh, Vivian, unfortunately, died uh, last episode. And yeah, if you want to see how, you got to check the, the last episode because I'm not... I'm really not... I'm really heartbroken by that, honestly. It, it was such an unfair uh, situation as well. But yeah, let's take on Karen here. Um... Hopefully, um, Bruno's ace was already level 53, which is very worrying, but we'll see. We'll see. I am Karen of the Elite Four. Your percent? How amusing. I love dark type Pokemon. I find their wild, tough image to be so appealing and they're so strong. Think you can take them? Just try to entertain me. Let's go. Is this a hint? Is this Let's Go Meryl? And Let's Go Snubble? Announced, basically. Technician Kate, why do you seem like to be in a swimsuit? Why do you have a Moltres? <laughs> why do you have a Moltres? I know I caught a Moltres, so I know it's typing for sure. Where is it? Did I not shut it down? Oh no. Please tell me I jotted it down. Because right now I don't remember. I don't remember. Don't remember. Is it really not here? Well, I do know we caught one. Right? This is so sad. <laughs> This is so sad. I have a weird feeling this is a an electric type. I'm gonna bring out Rowdy. Gonna risk it all. I know 
It shouldn't be... Yep, okay. Okay, I'm good, I'm good. We're good, we're good. Let's just go for a spike cannon. I just want to... Okay. Two is enough, Rowdy. You're doing good. You're going through pain, I know, so you're fine. No, don't worry, Rowdy. Don't worry. Everything will be alright. That's what I try to say to myself. Every night. <laughs> um, it's weird why I didn't shut it down, though. Uh, but I knew it was an electro type because I didn't add it to the squad um, during the grinding. And I think its special attack is actually pretty bad as well. So it didn't really go well. With each other. Um, Togetic, I just saw Togetic around. Chia. It's a water type. Level 54? Manny, it's your time. <laughs> Manny, it's your time. Unfortunately, you are the lowest level, but you are a grass type. So, he goes for Iron Tail. Please don't hurt me. PLEASE DON'T HURT ME! Oh, I got a crit. Okay, okay, okay. I'm a bit more... <laughs> ...relieved to see that it was a crit. Is Solar Beam weakened during rain in this gen as well? I guess we're gonna find out. Oh my god. Oh my god, I did zero. Manny! I guess it's not its fault, right? I have to check it out. Let's see if my... Okay Google works. Dun, dun, I have to... Uh, wait, let me see. Okay Google! No. It's not working. Voice recognition is <laughs> not activated. I'll just go through here. Um, but I will use... What is... Solar beams. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I hesitated. Okay, okay. Is solar beam weakened by rain in Gen 2? Oh, God damn it. it. This said it's solar being weakened. <laughs> okay, let me let me focus on this. <clears throat> Is solar beam? Weakened? Oh fucking hell, it doesn't give me a, a chance to, to say everything. Is Solar Beam weakened? Esther Beam weakened. Oh my god. This, this is just fucked. Is Solar Beam weakened in rain in Gen 2? Okay. <laughs> um, let me just see. Solar Beam, Bulbapedia. Thanks. Thank you so much. Okay, uh, let me just spore you. I don't want any shenanigans. This goes through the generations, so... Generation 1. Does nothing on its turn. Generation 2. The rain stopped, okay, thanks, uh, Togetic for the rain, that was pretty fun. Uh, Solar Beam will not need a turn to charge if the, uh, if used during Arsh Sunlight. It will have its power half if used during rain. That's all I needed. That was literally all I needed. <laughs> I'm sorry for that, I'm not good with technologies. <laughs> I'm an old person. I'm an old person to say the least. I did zero. Did I get a crit before? Or was I just really not paying attention? Don't use a max potion, bro. <laughs> Come on. I'm like... 
So breaking the fourth wall a bit here, I will go to work in like half an hour. So it's not that I'm rushing this. Of course I'm not. But I need to <laughs> I need this to to uh, to go well. <laughs> And this is just uh, wasting my time for no reason, basically. I'll just keep going for side beams. I have so many of them. I don't think I need to to save. <coughs> All right. <coughs> oh, that was a crit. <coughs> Still not enough to kill it. Unfortunately, still not enough to take him out. Now, it's done. And I'm still not level 46. <laughs> it's a deja vu, I think something like that happened um, last episode as well. Silver is level 52! I just beat off a... a whoa, pause. I just defeated a level 40... 54 now taking on a 52 and I have no clue about your typing I have a weird feeling you're a grass type a very weird feeling I guess we're gonna find out really soon I should have went for surf oh this is not very effective nightshade Oh my god, it's, is it a ghost and psychic then? Because psychic is the only thing that res I guess it could be a steel type. Psychic or steel are very different typings. Um, because if it was a steel type, I would go down to Patrick, but I think Rowdy is the best play, no matter what, especially if it goes for Nightshade again. Which it did. And I have two bone meringues, so hopefully... Oh, this has to be super effective. Yep. Alright, it's the steel type. That's good to know. I have to jot it down. I also have to use my agenda. <laughs> I haven't used it in like, almost a month. Two? Two months, maybe? Let me see. Once I open it, I will see. This is such a good agenda as well. It was my... Um mother-in-law that gave it to me. I know flamethrower was super effective on you, so I think I'll just do that. <laughs> I will literally just do that. Alright, let me jot down Slowbro, even for Toxic, okay. Uh, this is on the 16th of July, actually, uh, that I last used my thingy. That makes sense, it was when I was starting, restarting, yet again, my uploads, but I need this to be on the 28th, actually on the 29th, that's where I need to schedule my things, nice, good job, buddy, good job, Tsunami, you've been the MVP, actually, I can still uh, jot down some things here, but not right now, not right now, I'm working, god damn it, I am working, Still need to jot down uh, slow bro. I'm saying this so I don't forget. Blossom is a bug type. I just saw it right here. Sludge bomb. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. What did I say? Oh, uh, slow bro. I'm gonna put you right here. There's a space right here for you, slow bro. Slow bro. What did I say? Steel. Steel type. He could even not be a steel type, he could just be psychic and uh, electric, for example, or poison. Well, aren't you good? I like that in a trainer. Thanks, Karen. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. That is the that is only the selfish perception of people. Truly skilled trainers should try to win with their favorites. I like your style, you understand what's important. Go on! The champion is waiting. Is he now? 
is he waiting for me? Right, let me heal my mons up then. Because this will be a long fight. I know that. I know that for sure. Uh, I need you for... You, and then I'll use potions for the rest. Do -do 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 Alright. Um... I'm not really sure... I guess I have to lead off... No, I can't lead off with Manny. If I... Uh, if I think with such a... Um, such a bad typing against so many Pokemon that I really cannot lead off with... Um, Manny. I think I'll lead off with Patrick this time. Instead of Unprogrammed. This might be a choke. But we'll see. I just want to save unprogrammed for when it really matters, you know? Doesn't this auto walk me? Aha, there we go. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Percent. I knew that you, with your skills, would eventually reach me here. There is no need for words now. We will battle to determine who is the stronger of the two of us. As the most powerful trainer and as the Pokemon League champion, I, Lance the Dragon Master, accept your challenge. This theme is my favorite. Do -do -do -do. Botanist Joey! <laughs> okay, Botanist Joey. This is uh, officially a 5v6 as well. He leads off with a level 51! Oh no... He might even have a level 60. With this going on... It's a poison type. Okay. Not the most I'd... Oh, unprogrammed would have been the perfect one. <laughs> unprogrammed would have been the perfect one. Okay, um... Do I bring out Rowdy? I don't want to take unnecessary damage with Patrick in case I need to. Unprogrammed is very frail HP wise, so I think I will bring out Rowdy. If I let off with Manny, this would have been chaos. He goes for Sludge Bomb immediately. I just hope for one thing to not happen. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. I have one Bone Meringue. I think I'm gonna use it now. Just to take this Mon out, hopefully. Yep. Yep, yep, okay. One is down. One is down. We have five more to go. Ooh, sorry. Unknown. I saw a known around here. It's a bug type. So I don't think I should be worried. I have wing attack as well. So I think I'm gonna go for that. I have it here for a reason, right? Is that an Oko? Nice, Rowdy. Good job. Good job, Rowdy. Good job. Let's see. Seeking. Do I... Damn, I keep uh, messing up my posture. Uh, very unrelated, I know, but... Uh, it get, my back keeps hurting. I need to lay down so many times. <laughs> Uh, not really. I don't really need to lay down, uh, but I feel like lay down is how I need to be most of the time. I need to fix my posture as soon as possible. I still don't see seeking, um, even with this this filler arc about my back. Oh, I have Goldeen right here. It's a rock type. So unfortunately, <laughs> you're not doing too much here. Um, but I can bring Patrick pretty safely. As he goes for Spore. Is it a grass type as well? If he goes for a grass type move, I will be very worried. <laughs> Bro, is it a rock and 
Oh, I'm very afraid then. If it's rock and grass... I'd have to go out into many. I have to, uh, no matter what, I think. Because I have to take this... Um, this solar beam. Many can take it pretty easily. Yep, pretty easily, like I said. And I think I'm just gonna go for solar beam. If he spores me in the middle of a solar beam... Oh my god, we're both... <laughs> We're both exchanging power! <laughs> Who's the strongest solar beam? I have to jut down. Oh no. I didn't do too much, which is a bit unfortunate. Do I go for stun spore? That would be kind of a waste of a turn, but if he goes for spore, then that will be a. A big waste of a turn, I was about to say. <laughs> Alright, Manny, I need you to wake up. I need you to wake up, Manny. <laughs> Manny really hasn't done much this... <laughs> in this... Uh, oh my god, don't crit me. Come on. Why, why is it when I put them to sleep, they just never, ever... Okay, there we go. Finally woke up. Does he get paralyzed? Fully paralyzed, okay. I'm just gonna go for one Shadow Ball. I'm gonna risk this crit, I know. I'm risking a crit for... Well, actually, doesn't really matter. Unless he goes for... I should've just start Shadow Balling. <laughs> Initially, and he's fully paralyzed all the way. Okay. Whew, that was a bit stressful. That was a bit stressful, Manny. He almost gave me an art attack. Okay, three down. Oh, I love that animation. Level 54! <laughs> Level 54! Oh no. Um. This is this is a very rare Pokemon in this playthrough. So I really have no clue. Uh, I'll have to take a gamble, but not with many. Because many would be a guaranteed death here. I think I'm gonna Oh boy. Patrick is asleep. So I think I can go out to Patrick. Since he's asleep, he can take a hit, and I can uh, try to figure out the typing from the movie Ghost War. Toxic. Okay, it might be a poison type, so I'm just gonna try to go for a waterfall. Just to see. He goes for Nightmare! There's no way. Can I wake up? Oh no, Patrick, come on. gonna do 25% of my HP conversion to... Can I wake up now? Thank you. Oh, that did zero. He went to water type. Okay, I'm gonna go for dynamic punch then. Oh, I hit! Please? Oh, that was so close. But he is confused. Come on, hit yourself! You went for toxic, okay. That's fine, that's fine. That's fine, I don't mind. I only take the damage now that I attack. Alright. Four down. Four down. Two more to go to be the champion. Slowking. So, from what I learned about Slowbro, He's a Steel-type. I missed. 
He went for Nightmare. That was an odd choice. Can I land? Oh, I did. That was super effective. This has to knock him out. This is Black Belt Boosted. I landed so many dynamic punches, which is kind of crazy. I never got, I never said anything, because I didn't want to miss one more. <laughs> Level 57! Jesus! But this is, should be easy food for Tsunami here. Right? He goes for Sludge Bomb. Hopefully I don't take too too much damage. Even if I got poison there, I would be fine. Because we're toxic. Every single thing is toxic. Every single thing is a poison type in this one. And here comes the flamethrower. Alright, I think... I think this was a very successful... Oh? I was, I was shooting... We have an expression here, which is... Oh, come on. <laughs> we have an expression here that uh, says... Uh, we were shooting fireworks before the party. Which is when you're celebrating... Oh my god. <laughs> when you're celebrating something way too early. In a cocky, um, in a cocky way. That's basically what it means, yeah. It's over. Oh, sorry. <coughs> it's over. But it's an odd feeling. I'm not angry that I lost. In fact, I feel happy. Happy that I witnessed the rise of a great new champion. Whew. And we got rich off of that. <laughs> Whew. You have become truly powerful, Percent. Your Pokemon have responded to your strong and upstanding nature. As a trainer, you will continue to grow strong with your Pokemon. How do you know that? Oh, it, oh, it's Mary. Oh no, it's all over. Professor Oak, if you weren't so slow. Ah, ah, percent. It's been a long while. Uh, you certainly look more impressive. Uh, your conquest of the league is just fantastic. Your dedication, trust, and love for your Pokemon made this happen. Your Pokemon were outstanding too. Because they believed in you as a trainer, they persevered. <laughs> that was a long word. <laughs> Congratulations, Percent. Let's interview the brand new champion. Enough. <laughs> this is getting to be... Uh, it's getting to be a bit too noisy. Percent, could you come with me? Oh wait, we haven't done the interview. Do 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 do. It's been a long time since I last came here. This is where the, we honored the league champions for all eternity. Their courageous Pokemon are also inducted. Here today, we witnessed the rise of a new league champion, a trainer who feels compassion for and trust toward all Pokemon, a trainer who succeeded through perseverance and determination, the new league champion who has all the makings of greatness, percent, allow me to register you and your partners as champions. Even though we lost our starter Pokemon, she will still be remembered as a champion. That's always good to hear. And that's it for Johto, basically. That really is for it for Johto, and I'm glad it went A-OK. -okay. Next episode, uh, I'm probably just gonna... I think I can backtrack immediately to go to Lugia and ho, -Ho maybe. I'll have to check that uh, off-screen. But yeah, next time we'll basically go into Kanto. Um, and oh, not Vivian. <laughs> not Vivian. But yeah, that's it for Jota. I always said, and <laughs> you, you, I, you need to fill your up the Pokedex, catch different kinds of Pokemon. Um. 
like I said since the beginning, uh, I will do Kanto. That's not a, a question to be asked. Um, Kanto will be done. Because that's uh, <laughs> one of the best parts of this game, honestly. Is going back to Kanto and going through the gym challenge basically all over again. Uh, in regards uh, to grinding and team members and all of that, I'm quite happy with the team we have right now. But I guess we'll kind of have to see. <sighs> Sorry, I was yawning. I guess we'll kind of have to see. Um, I'm gonna wait, basically, to add a new team member. I want to add it immediately. And, um... And yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> um, next time we'll, we'll, I'm just waiting for the credits to end, basically, to also end the episode, but... Yeah, I'm also planning some uh, series for Unite. Because I know that's um, something that people are very interested on, and all, from what I do. Uh, I know this series isn't as popular, but I love doing um, these playthroughs. And then Bastion, hopefully today, um, I'm doing this on Sunday, hopefully today I can finish it once I get home after work, because I will be, uh, I am working at a bar as well during weekends, so um, it's been a bit rougher and I couldn't actually, um, I wasn't actually here at the, the beginning of this morning. Oh, can I, can I click? Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's basically about it. Um, this, this episode it will be go, going uh, on Wednesday, I'm pretty sure. So we should be good to go in regards to that. Uh, I know the game is saved, but I want to save myself. Um, but yeah, it should be it should be all ready to go. Um, I'll figure out if we can get Ho and Lugia right now, and I'll figure out everything else as we go. <laughs> basically. Uh, but yeah, if you enjoyed this episode and want to show your support here, make sure you smash the like button and subscribe because your support is very, very much appreciated. Uh, other than that though, that'll be it for today. Thank you so, so much for watching though. This has been 88% and I'm out.